Now in beauty, we are joined by Trudy, who has the difference between a serum and a moisturiser and why you need both. Morning, Trudy. Morning, how are you? I'm very, very well. Good. So first up, what is a face serum? Okay, the difference between a face serum and a moisturiser is actually not only how they look, but what they do for your skin. So a serum is a lot more watery than a um, moisturiser. It contains potent ingredients that are really small, so they absorb really quickly and they um, condition your skin. So if you think of a serum as a skin conditioner and a moisturiser as a hydrator, that's probably the best way okay, to Okay, so they're it. not the same thing, obviously. They're definitely not the same thing, although it's a bit confusing because ser some serums do add some hydration to, to your skin, but they don't they don't form that barrier over your skin like a moisturiser. Right, they're not the creaminess, they're more the watery. And they're a completely different texture. Okay, so who should use one? Everyone. I mean, the great thing about a serum is that they are targeted. They're targeted skincare. And when I say targeted, I mean they correct problems in your skin. So if you've got very oily skin, you can get a serum that will calm that. If you've got concerns about ageing, wrinkles, fine lines, brown spots, you can get a serum with ingredients that target that too. So everyone can use one. And the thing is that they just slot into your skincare routine. You don't have to follow a family of products. You can use a serum from a different company and just slot it into your normal routine. So would you be using two serums at once or not? Um, so you've got two you different can, conditions. You definitely can, yeah. And you can use them morning and night or just in the morning, depending on the one that you choose. Um, I often mix my serum with my moisturiser just to give my moisturiser a bit more potency. Um, so they're very uh, flexible, I guess is a good word. They're really flexible and they're something that anyone can add to a routine easily. How often should I use it? Should I be using it every day? I think you could probably do with using it in the morning. You know, you've got a very busy morning. Someone like you needs a bit of an energy boost in the morning. Yes. Although at night time, if you're feeling really dehydrated and your skin's looking really dull, then at night as well. It really does depend on the product you choose and your skin type. Okay. What about what, what about a serum and a face oil? They're very different as well, aren't they? They're very different. Like I said, watery, it's more liquidy in consistency, whereas an oil is pure oil, so it does completely different things. An oil forms that barrier over your skin. Um, great combination together actually because the serum absorbs really quickly and the oil forms the barrier to lock those ingredients into the skin. So you'd, put the, you'd put the serum then the oil on? Yeah. The serum is the first thing you put on after cleansing. Oh, good to know because I get confused all yeah. these things like what am I meant to put on first. Uh, what about an essence? What's an essence? You know essence. an essence is another thing that confuses people but if you think of an essence more like an upmarket toner or an upmarket freshener it contains similar potent ingredients but it's very liquidy and it tends to refresh the skin rather than hydrate the skin. Okay so if I was going to put them in an order what would I do? I'd cleanse? Cleanse, essence, serum, moisturiser and SPF. Okay, got They're it. They're like Good. a Korean range of, you know, Korean women have the most complicated skincare routines. Most New Zealand women don't want complication, which is why a serum's great. Okay, so what's this one? Okay, so this is the first one up and it's really exciting. Now this, to confuse you even more, is a pre-serum. So this product helps protect your skin or your Lanahan cells, which sit on the surface of the skin. You say it was a pre-serum. It's a pre-serum, I know, I just want to confuse <laughs> everybody. So the idea with the pre-serum is that it actually protects your skin, forms a barrier, adds these beautiful ingredients. It's got ginkgo in it, um, a reishi mushroom mm. extract, iris root, and it actually gives your skin, strengthens your skin and protects it. So Ultimune, it gives your skin the most amazing radiance. It smells beautiful oh. too. What about this one? So this one just launched last week from Dermalogica. Um, they've been a bit quiet lately with um, great innovation, but this is really clever. It's called Biolumin C, and obviously it's full of vitamin C, and they've actually worked out how to encapsulate vitamin C so that it stays potent. And it's also got a, um, a vitamin in it, a peptide in it, which helps strengthen and firm your skin. That is a mm. brilliant serum for the morning. So pop that on under your moisturiser in the morning, just to give you that radiance that your skin needs. So that's the morning one. What about this one? Um, this one's been around for a while and it's actually one of my faves. Ultraceuticals, a spa brand. Um, Ultra B Hydrating Serum. This is stacked with hyaluronic acid and you would have seen this a lot when you're looking at beauty products on the label. Um, it can bind moisture up to about 5,000 times its own weight. So it's ultra hydrating. So if you've got a dehydrated skin, winter ideal time. So even though this is, it's, it's, it says it's a hydrating one, you'd still use a moisturiser as well? You right? still need to use a moisturiser. I can often pop that in my moisturiser, that one, and okay. to add that potency. And I bought this one in, Pure Fiji. This is their multi-active serum. A lot of people know that there is a body range, but not a lot of people know that they have a beautiful skincare range They've got a beautiful well. body range. Natural 
it's got hydrosols in it. Um, when they create all their body products and they use distilling process for the plants and nuts and oils, the water that comes off that goes into the skincare range. So it's really potent, full of oil and moisture. Wow, how good are my hands going to be by oh, the table? Oh, I know. And, and finally from Swiss, which is a vitamin brand, they have a skincare range as well. And this one uses Sicilian orange and it's beautiful. Again, for our natural skin lovers, you know, you can't ignore Ooh, that. I think a I lot of people that. want that's right. You can do anything you want. Pumping it is better because it keeps it um, clean and fresh from the oxygen. Yep. Um, so, yeah, so that one, Sicilian um, olive leaf, it's mm, really it's beautiful. beautiful. It's completely natural, so it's beautiful if that's what you're looking for from a beauty product. Excellent. Always great to have you in Trudy with all these amazing products. Thank you so Pleasure. much. And for more great beauty know how, head to Trudy's website, beautyeq.co.nz.